This video will be on cloud-based versus on-premises vulnerabilities. On-premises require a computer server with redundancies on-site to run multiple things like security and access control. In addition to the hardware, company purchases a license that allows them to run necessary software on their local servers and ensure it's all secure. With an on-premise security technology, the company has to hunt for what they need and the company is responsible for their own mistakes. This is good in a way because it provides a full system control, local data storage, and maximum uptime. At the same time, it can be difficult to manage, like if you have numerous vendors, because certain hardware and software might not be the right solution for certain tasks. If you have numerous vendors, it means you have multiple hardware and software solutions from multiple third parties. It's hard to manage it especially with continuous patches and updates. Also, third-party companies tend to discontinue certain products and you will need to replace them with another solutions which you need to hunt for. Not only that, you have configurations and permissions that has to be set all separately. This leads to lack of scalability and flexibility. But most of all, it creates a lot of vulnerabilities. Cloud-based technology runs a system of remote servers on the internet, meaning you don't need a dedicated server specialist on-site to maintain them because it's taken care for you. Their services provide multiple things from 24-hour troubleshooting, monitoring and supervision of the servers, security of the data, encryption updates, backup recovery, performance checks, and much more. Cloud is great due to remote management, increased efficiency, enterprise scalability, and it is future-proof, meaning the architecture is designed to ensure it doesn't need a complete redesign. Main concerns with clouds are limitations when it comes to customizations and specific compliance restrictions. Certain cloud technology may not meet the specific regulations or requirements that the company may need. Most companies shoot for hybrid solutions, but are beginning to transition more and more into cloud, because they're providing more and more solid architecture that fills in gaps that were previously there.